Blessed be the name of the Lord. He's worthy. Holy hand. Distinguished clergy, I welcome you all on behalf of the President of the Republic to Jubilee House, the seat of government for this important prayer breakfast. With the President this morning, I have the Honorable Chief of Staff, the Presidential Coordinator for Canaveral Virus, Dr. Anefi Asamwaba, and I have the Presidential Advisor on Health, Dr. Anthony Nsia Asari. I believe the Minister of Health is yet to join us. Amen. Rejoice and praise the Lord. Rejoice and praise the Lord. My soul, my soul, rejoice. Lord's Prayer. Our, Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, come. thy will be done on earth from death, as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those that trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom the power and the glory forever and ever. Amen. Thank you. I'll invite the Right Reverend Paul Waffle for the benediction. To God our help be made this fast. Who has been our hope for the years to come? We give you all the glory. We give you all the honor. For our existence, for our creation, for us as a nation, for us as your people. Herein gathered are your sons and daughters who know you by your name, the name that is above all, the name that heals, the name that conquers, the name that delivers, the name that brings healing unto people. Lord, we cry unto you and ask that you will be the God who will go before your people. You will be the God who will cover our defenseless hurts. You will be the God who will be with us in these times of crisis. We know you as the God who speaks and the dead receive new life. And that is why we call on you, the God who brings blessings unto your people. And so as a nation, we are gathered, lifting high holy hands unto you and crying 
unto you our God. The God who has been with us all these years. The God who has been with us, who was with our fathers and our mothers. We have known you to be the God who accompanies. And so in these times, we ask for your blessings. And so unto this God, who breathes unto the dry bones to have new life, we commit our nation, Ghana. Unto this God, who heals his people, we commit our nation, Ghana. Unto this God, who goes before his people and grants them deliverance and conquest mm -hmm. on their behalf, we commit this nation. The Lord bless us and keep us. The Lord make his face to shine upon us and be gracious unto us. May his goodness and may his mercies follow us all the days ahead. And may we see him as the God who delivered us. Because he is in our boat, we will smile at the storm in which we find ourselves. Lord, speak. Lord, speak. Yes. Lord, speak now yes. unto us. May his blessings be upon us now and forevermore. Amen. Amen. Please be seated. My Savior is me. And for my beliefs, will soon be happy. My credit is soon. With Christ in that vessel, I smile at the storm. Um, members of the media, I don't think the Ghanaian people...